Hey guys, welcome back. Cricket here with another plan with me. This one is in my Erin Condren for the week of the 10th through the 16th. I'm using this adorable kit from DEK D Designs and I had to get it. It's called Naughty Gnomes and I had to have it for Valentine's. I think it is just the most adorable kit ever. I think it's funny and, you know, Valentine's Day to me necessarily is not like my favorite biggest favorite holiday so you know putting a little fun into it makes it all better I'll go ahead and apologize about my nails I've been moving into a new shop which I will talk to you about here in a little bit and um, pretty much had to take my gel polish off and cut my nails down so when I do that then when I do hair color for my clients it colors my nails so I'll go ahead and apologize so but here's your full boxes and your quarter boxes your days of the week and I did use um, pink polka dots Lily's Shattered Glass um, Date Dots, and I'm hoping it shows up a little bit better. There we go. And then here's your bottom washies and your washi strips, your headers, half boxes, scallop, um, habit trackers, sidebar, weekend banner, banner for your weekend, um, washi strips in um, appointment boxes, then your heart check boxes and heart check flags, um, corner flags and then bows, your headers with little things, and then your um, large flags with your heart icons, and again, another washi strip, and I'll just, like I said, in some deco, and I think that kit is so cute. I'm going to use this from So Cute Planner. Um, it's their holographic, it's a holographic, um, foil washi. Let's see if I can get it. There you go. And then this bow right here is from Coffee Break Planner. So I thought it would be really cute. And thank God that this week is done in like a rosy pink color. That way I don't have to do a bunch of white out. That was, it drives me crazy. I'm not even gonna, you, know, you guys know it. It just drives me crazy. So Let's get started. Um, I have some stuff to talk to you about. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah, I did not get to plan with me last week. It was just hectic. I had a lot on my mind. And if you watched my very last plan with me, then you would know what's going on. Um, just trying to decide on whether or not to um, change locations of my salon. Um, it was, it would be in the same building, but the suite would be different and the suite would be bigger. And I kind of prayed about it, put like a little fleece out about it. Um, and, um, it came out in my favor. So we are definitely moving. I've got to actually move in this by the 15th, I think. So I'm switching salons by the 15th, plus working 13 hour days, plus, um, you know, wrestling, wrestling practice, wrestling tournaments, you know, the, all of that. So just saying, it's been kinda crazy. And, um, but love and life, so it's all good. I, um, um, so I am excited about the move, but it's gonna be, a, it's a lot of work, so. But hopefully I can take some pictures of it and I'll put it on here for you to see. So, because y'all have given me so much encouragement and stuff, um, I feel like I'm doing the journey, I'm having y'all do the journey with me, and that means even more to me because, um, I feel like I have somebody on my side and and friendship and stuff means the world to me. And I have gotten a lot of planner friends and I am truly, truly blessed. So I thank y'all so much for your encouragement. And then I need to thank y'all for your love of Garrett. Um, the last time I spoke to you, he was going, he was going to a huge tournament. And <clears throat> he wrestled the first guy. He beat the first guy. He pinned him. And then the second guy, I don't know why that is not, like, lining up for me. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Well, 
Hello Cricut? Probably because everything else is wrong. So let me pull all of this up and let me put this down a little bit straighter. Um, so the second boy he had to wrestle, he, um, that boy had beaten him in the earlier in the season. He is huge. He, um, came in second place. Um, during a real big tournament. And um, so, you know, it was really stressful. I'm not gonna lie. So he gets up there and um, he, um, they're wrestling. And I think the boy just thought, okay, I got this because I already had him before. I don't know what the boy was thinking. But anyway, lo and behold, it goes down to overtime. And they are tied. Overtime, first time. Then they get out, tied again, second overtime. And by this time, I'm like, I'm like freaking out. I'm almost in tears because, I mean, this is a major tournament. This is like, um, it's a regional tournament. So, I mean, that's getting his name up there and out there. So, um, <clears throat> he goes they go into ultimate overtime and I have a boy sitting there telling me another wrestler telling me because I never seen it go into ultimate overtime. You usually don't see that with heavyweights. So I didn't know exactly what was happening or what could happen. And I mean, seriously, it could have went either way. Well, the boy sitting next to me, the wrestler sitting next to me gave me the wrong information. So, I mean, I was almost in tears because, um, Garrett had the boy down on the floor if you don't know anything about wrestling, I apologize. And if you don't want to hear this, you can fast forward, I promise. Um, he had him down. He was down. And then um, the boy told me all he has to do is get up and that guy wins. Well, he gets up. And that wasn't the case. He didn't. It wasn't. Because it was overtime, they had to see who got the first down, I guess is how you say it. I don't know. But anyway, so we're at, now we're officially at ultimate overtime. I see my son look at one of my um, other wrestling moms. And he's not looking at me. He's looking at her. He's down on all fours, and she's like, stand, like she is actually sitting in front of him. And um, all I saw was his head go up and down like he was saying yes to her. And then the next thing I know, he comes, he gets up, we're all screaming, and all he has to do is get released by that other guy. And he did. And when he did, he won. And oh my God, I started crying. The mom that was talking to him started crying. Um, we hugged. He couldn't even get to me because everybody was like jumping up and down. The coach, um, what, one of the coaches was so excited, he couldn't even contain himself. He started texting his um, his wife because his wife couldn't be there. So he started texting her and, um, and everything. And then finally Garrett gets to me and he just hugs me. It was the longest hug he's ever given me. And I mean, I was crying. He was trying to breathe. He was breathing so heavy. I was, I was a little scared at first. Um, but that's a lot of weight. Garrett was like, when they weighed in, Garrett was exactly 20 pounds um, lighter than this boy. So this boy was exactly 285, barely probably. And then um, he was also a senior. So that was the most amazing. So I sit there and I'm trying to, he's getting ready to get up on the podium. I'm trying to video him getting his name announced for his dad because his dad could not be there. So his dad doesn't know yet, right? And so I'm like, Shh, everybody would cry, which wasn't happening because of course everybody was excited. Um, the next thing I know, his coach comes over and he's like, I text Randy and I said, what? I said, I wanted to surprise him by like sending him a text message of hearing him, his name his son's name being called. He's like, I'm so sorry. He was so apologetic. He was all upset. And um, I said, it's okay. It's not a big deal. It's fine. You know, whatever. It's, it's totally cool. I think that it was, you know, I thought it was, 
cool that he was excited for his his wrestler. So anyway, I did get the video and I got Garrett went over there and he actually hugged his opponent and I got a picture of that, which was amazing. And then I stopped um, before the pictures were even being done. Um, I walked over and the boy was being talked to by his coach. And I told the coach, I said, I'm so sorry. I don't mean to interrupt y'all. But, and then I looked at the boy, and the boy's name was Sean, and I looked at him, and I said, you know what? I said, that was one awesome match, um, I and I am so proud of you, like that. And he kind of looked at me, like, strange. Like, he never heard anybody say that or do that. And I said, and he looked at me, and he said, thank you. And so I walked off, and then that's when we did the pictures and stuff. But, um, yeah, so now my son is the Region 3 5A champ heavyweight champ so that was so exciting yeah region three five a heavyweight champ so i wanted to make sure i said it right so yeah and um so very exciting very very exciting and um that was two weeks ago so on to the reason my voice is acting a fool right now is because he had a tournament last night actually and um they uh he was going against um he was going against the number one champ heavyweight at another tournament this boy was at another tournament and again this boy has beaten Garrett before too so he gets down there and I mean, I really thought that, I mean, I'm not saying he's gonna lose, but I, I wasn't sure what was gonna happen. And I don't think Gary even knew what was gonna happen, but he gets there, they start wrestling. And the next thing you know, the, the boy tries to do a, uh, a move on Garrett and Garrett took advantage of it and put him in a headlock pretty much. And, um, Um, pinned him. He actually pinned him. And that was the number one guy that beat everybody. So, I mean, that, we, again, tears. So I'll probably, tr I'll try to, if I can remember, to put pictures up at the end of both of those. Because, you know, your support and me and encouraging words for Garrett mean the world to me. Absolutely the world to me. And, um, I'm so blessed to have each and every one of y'all that supports us. So, thank you. Thank you so much. <clears throat> so, yeah. They did, the school did lose. Um, but, it's okay. You know, it, it is what it is. So, um, but they only lost by, by one match. It came down to the last match. So, it was all good. All good. So, okay, so I'm going to use this one as my, of course, my um, main sticker here. So, and I think he's cute for Valentine's Day, so I think we're going to use that one. Um, I really want to use that one, to be honest with you, so I might. I'm not sure yet, but, um, yeah, so it has been very exciting. It has been a couple stressful weeks, and I apologize for not... Um, doing a plan with me. Um, I just, it's just honest to God, I just did not have it in me. I don't know what happened or why. Um, it just, it was what it was. So I do apologize. But I have a, um, I have a lot of sticker hauls for y'all and, um, stuff like that. So we'll definitely, um, have those up and ready for you. And um, I will try to do my best to be better, keep you up to date on what's going on with the um, shop and stuff like that. Yeah, I'm a little nervous, I gotta get it all done. The only bad thing is, I mean, half the stuff I need to move, I need it this week. So that's throwing me off a little bit. And the sticker is driving me crazy and I don't have my nails, so I don't have anything to help me. 
like I'm used to. So there we go. Okay, it was just driving me a little bit crazy. And I'm hoping it's not, it's dark in here because it's nighttime. I am taping this at night. So um, I apologize. So let's get that on there. And then, of course, I'm going to do this one as the weekend or the Saturday and Sunday. Right there. And then this one. Right here. Okay. And then uh, I'm going to go ahead and put my littles down and my um, um, food icons or food ones down too. And I will be right back. I'm not going to make you sit here and watch that. So, all right, I'll be right back. Okay, got those down. And I'm going to do my um, weekend banner. I'm excited to see this get done. So let's see. I try to do, sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. You can hear my voice. I was screaming so loud last night. I couldn't even contain myself. I'm not even gonna lie. It was amazing. And I'm so proud of my boy. He gives me a fit all the time, but I still love him. You know, that's what mamas do. Okay, so I gotta do that one. That one. Let's do that. See, sometimes putting it down the middle works, sometimes it does not. So, of course, this would be the time that it didn't when I told you it would. So, yeah, just saying. And then this one right there. And then I think I'm going to use, let's see, I'm hoping this fits. Right there, it does. But I wanna say it's too, no, I like that, that looks good, that's fine. And then, Last but not least, is it bad I'm already looking forward to the weekend already? Ugh, how terrible am I? I'll put that one right there. And there is your gorgeous weekend banner. So I love it. Perfect. And so this is what it's looking like so far. Cute, huh? Very, very cute. I'm so in love with it. So let's get to, I'm going to use, let me see, hold on one second. So I got these right here from Pink Polka Dot Lily, and they're like, um, they're white heart, um, come on Cricket, get it out of your mouth, headers, So I went, and they're holographic, they're the same as, they're probably shattered glass, which she knows that's my favorite. I'm gonna put that there just carefully for right now. And then find my hugs and kisses and make sure that I'm covering up most of it. And what I don't cover up, I will use um, the deco for. So I'm gonna put that back right there. And then I also wanted to see if I could use this. We're gonna play with it, I'm gonna try. But it's from So Cute Planner, and it's like for the Galaxy, but I thought it would be cute on here. And it too is holographic, so I thought maybe I could use this, and it would be adorable, and it would work out. And it did! It gave it just enough. Look at there. So cute. Okay, so use that, and then I got another one of these. Maybe if I can reach it with my finger. And I'm gonna put that one right there. Okay, so that finishes off the, that. Too cute, okay. And then, all right, I've got my 
I got my pill trackers right here. These are from Creative Cavern Studio. I do have a code for her. And like I said before, all my um, all of the, my stuff will be down in the description below. So I'm going to use this pink one. I think it actually worked out really pretty. Um, like perfect. So put that there. Okay, and then let's see. We can use another one of these. Put that one right. There. These are cute. And we'll put this down right underneath it, and then this down, and then. Okay, perfect. And then I got these made by um, Cheerful Planner Girl. She does custom scripts. So I'm going to put this one down for. Um, Randy works, so I can write down his work schedule, so we can keep that in track. So I do have a code for her. Okay, and then I need, let's do the dark one right here. And then I have these to remind me to take my makeup off. I love these little eyelashes. So I'm gonna do that right there. And then one more of these. Right there. And then I am trying, um, those of y'all, some of you know, some of you don't, I'm trying to do Weight Watchers, I'm on the purple plan. So if anybody else is on the purple plan, give me a shout out and maybe we can swap some recipes and stuff because, you yeah. know. You get bored eating the same stuff all the time. So for that one, though, I'm going to put workouts. And let's see. I'm going to start working out was the whole reason for that. So I'll put that there. Right there. This right here. Right there. And then I can use, let's see. Errands. I can use errands for that one. Okay, so I want to use errands for that one right there. And there is your sidebar. Lovely. Okay, so let's see. There is some things that I do have to keep in mind about. Um, let's see. Use this right here. It is coffee cups from Pink Polka Dot Lily. I adore her coffee cups. I'm gonna put that right there. And I'm gonna put that, let's see. I'm gonna put it right here, like that. And then this one right here for Coffee Monday. And then I'm gonna do one for Coffee Tuesday as well. There. Let me grab that one again because Tuesday is actually my Monday, so but I am gonna still put it there. Love them, love them, love them. Okay, and then let's see. I know I'm gonna go ahead and use these work um, stickers, so because I do work. Oh, that's workout. Lord have mercy. Sorry. I thought she had work. Does she not? Okay, she does. So I'm going to put work here. Work. Oh. And then I'm going to put the blue work here. Okay, that's awesome. Then Wednesday night, we have to go to, my son has a um, Meet the Bearcats. It's where they introduce all the fall and spring, I believe, or no, winter and fall sports. So he will be getting that done. He's gonna put like remember. So I'm gonna put this right here on the remember. So do not wanna forget that. Okay, so there's that. And then he does have practice, though. So 
He does have practice here. So I'm just going to put this down for right now. He may have practice here. I'm not too sure. So I'm going to put that down. Um, let's put this one down for here. And then I'm going to use this one right here. And this will be my move-in day to my new salon right there. So really quickly, on Monday, I am praying that I can go and get her to do my nails. Um, she's actually been on vacation, so even if I wanted to, I couldn't get them done. I don't cheat on my nail tech. I don't want people cheating on me, so I don't cheat on them. And I got these from So Cute Planner. And I think I'm going to go ahead and just use the blue one. I think No, I can use the purple one. Purple one will work. I'm just going to put that down about getting my nails done. Code for her in my link tree. Menu plan. I do that on Wednesday. I'm going to put it down at the bottom. Then order groceries on Thursday. And pick up on Friday. Oh, and I'm down to the last one on this one, so I think I had one on the other one, too. So definitely got to pick those up. And then I do my meal prep for the rest of the week. I will do it on Monday now, so that'll be there. So I'm going to put that down here for meal prep. And those are from Pink Polka Dot Lily. Um, I wash the towels. These are from DEK Design. I wash the towels on Thursday. So I'm going to put, oh, I think I wash them Thursday night. I take them home Thursday night, I should say. I'm going to go ahead and put down, well, maybe if I can reach it. I put that one down for here. I'm pretty sure he's going to have to have um, wrestling practice there, though. I'm not sure about. Um, I'm not sure about Valentine's Day. Coach really doesn't care about stuff like that. So, you might have it there. So, just be on the safe side. I'm going to put that there. And then, back to where I was. To take the trash cans down on Monday. And this is from Cheerful Planner Girl. And it's Nixie Take Out the Trash. I will weigh in on Monday. These are from Creative Cavern Studio. So I'm going to use this pink one right here. Do that. I have to do text reminders on Monday. Y'all already know my schedule because my, my loyal customers who've never strayed from me knows these are what I have to do every day. So text reminders are all on now. And those are made by... Cheerful Planner Girl. She does two different sizes. She does regular size and itty bitty. These are the itty bitties. These are the itty bitties. So I do the wash for us on Monday. And those are from Creative Cavern Studio. That is Adrian, by the way. So cute. Then I do the bank deposit. I probably will use this one. This is from Peppermint Planner. And I will do bank deposit. I'm going to just put that right here on Friday. So that works. And then I'm going to put her here. She's from So Cute Planner. Her name's Daisy and it says payday. So I'm going to put her right. Mm, let's put her right here. Right there. I got these from Winterfield Studios. And these are, um, I play. PR for her as well. Again, down in the information down below. And since I'm going to be working out, just because it's like a little, like it's, I'm just going to put it like that, right there. And I do have a code for her, by the way. And I got this freebie from BNR. They are also from a shop that I PR for. So I am going to put these up here to represent Valentine's Day. Right there, and I just about messed up, didn't I? 
don't know why I keep thinking Valentine's Day is on Thursday, but it's not. It's right there. So I'll put those there. And then um, I was trying to see. I could use this little house for move-in day. So I'm going to put that right there for move-in day. I think that's cute. I love to use these little um, freebies. I mean, they're so awesome to have. And I got these little Yodas, another cute as a button from So Cute Planner. I definitely want to use um, them before I don't have a chance to. So I'm going to put Yoda right here on Friday. But aren't those cute? So cute. But you could use these for Valentine's Day, um, anniversaries, any of that. So, And then I have, we have family time on Sunday. So I'm just going to put that down. Oh, I keep pulling up my foil. So I'm just going to put that down right here. Actually, you know what? No. I'm going to put it right here. Because it deserves to have that spot right there. And those are from So Cute Planner. And then let's do... I guess I'm going to have to put... Let's put him right here to hold my washi tape down. I don't know why he's being... Or why it's misbehaving, but... I'm going to put one right here. Too cute. And then, let's see. I know I have to cover this up right here, so let's see what we want to use. There we go. Put that one there. Then I can use hugs and kisses on the Monday and Tuesday because, you know, like I said, those are my days to... You know what? I could have used... I think I'm going to because... Oh, just rip up my thing real quick. I think I'm going to use... Perfect. Covered it completely up. Awesome. Cute. And then I can use him right there or her or whatever. And then this one right here. And chocolates right there. Book of Love right there, and then let's do President right there. Okay, guys, I think that's it for this week. I think it turned out really, really cute, full of fun. Sorry, I just hit my camera. Um, I was trying to tell myself not to clean up while I was talking to you. I have a bad habit of that, and I apologize so much. So, um, But this is the week, and I hope you enjoyed the plan with me. This bow turned out perfect for this, and I'm so glad I picked it out, and that Catherine had it from Coffee Break Planner. So, I hope you all have an awesome, blessed week. I hope uh, Cupid is good to you, and um, I hope you're good to Cupid, and I hope that you come back and see me real, real quick and real soon. Don't forget I have um, Plan With Me's sticker hauls, and you can find them on my planner nina underscore cricket on facebook or on instagram and it tells you when i have them up all right if you love this video please give me a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already subscribed hit that bell and i hope to see you back here real soon happy valentine's day